Hi guys, this is Boy Binky. I'm back for another video. Today I walk you through how to solve the lab SQL injection query in the database type and version on MySQL and Microsoft. This lab continues SQL variables in the product category filter. You can use a new attack to retrieve in the results the result from the inject query to solve the lab display data version. Uh, let's open our this lab from there. Make sure your proxy is on and wait for a second to load the lab and make that intercept is on and we hit any category here, we hit give and go back. What's going on? And go back to our verb. Sorry. We go back back to our verb and make sure that Fox proxy is drawn and hit in the gift category and back to our verb suite and send the request to repeater and make intercept is off and go back to your repeater and need to determine the number of the columns that are being retained by the query by using order by order by one and comment the rest of query and control you and set the request you see we have 500 internal server error because we dealing with mail and microsoft we go to our sheet sheet and looking for comments you know when we we make in common we use the hash and let's back to our query and change that to dashes to hash and says request and wait for a second send again you see we have 200 okay that means we have one column let's test if we have two column and send the request again you see we have two 200 okay that means we have two column let's see if we have three column and set the request again you see we have 500 internal server error that means we have two column the is determine which column contains string string value data out text data by using a union attack let's delete our old query we use an union an union select Let's test column number one. A uh, column number two null. Remember, we're dealing with uh, Oracle. We're dealing with Microsoft and MySQL database. We use hash or Arnovas name it and select our query control U in the Windows or command U in the Mac. You see that mean column number one contains string value and let test column number two and send the request you see we, we have two we have a string in the column number two and the goal of the lab is to display that version database version just back to our sheet here and looking for database version we're dealing with Microsoft and MySQL. You see, the, the both one the same thing. Uh, let's build our query. Select the old one. We use a new in attack. Select add add. With the capital, sorry. Version and null and comment the rest of query and you need to select your query and control you in the Windows or command you in the Mac and send the request. You see we have two hundred K that means we solve the lab. 
see we display the version of database let's back to our lab and refresh the page you see we solve the lab and this video for today hope you hope for you and don't forget to subscribe my channel to see new stuff and see you next time guys bye bye